1920, when Chaplin wanted to show the anguish of childhood, he dared to gamble. He was the first to select an actual child to enact a leading dramatic role. In the process, he created a prototype for future filmmakers, the child as waif. The film was the kid, the child, Jackie Coogan. The impact of the kid with Chaplin was tremendous because it was the first time that a child was featured and it changed my life uh, immensely because uh, it established me uh, overnight. The second picture that I did was Peck's Bad Boy and it was a, a fitting picture because it was very, very American and very small townish. When they released Peck's Bad Boy, it bore out the ideas and thoughts that my father had on how to promote a child because it was a terrific hit, although the picture only cost $30,000 to make. Following Peck's Bad Boy, my dad uh, decided that the public wanted to see a child in dire straits, an abandoned waif, an orphan. simple stories in which we did 70% comedy. And 30% pathos. Always we had one big gut-wrenching crying scene that was the payoff in the picture. It worked very well for us because people wanted to have their three handkerchief pictures in those days. Now we're really rolling. In 1922, I was the number one box office in the world. And the fame and the adoration that the public bestowed on me was rather frightening. At this time, I was earning, uh, just from motion pictures, about $500,000 a year. And uh, I had innumerable outside interests, uh, endorsements of, uh, of product and uh, food and uh, clothing, so that uh, I was earning about a million dollars a year, all told. Jackie Coogan's waif hungered for a family, for a home. It was a hunger audiences everywhere seemed to share. 